like it or not, vertical video is here to stay. And while platforms like TikTok let you film and edit videos right in the app, if you're serious about growing your social media and want your videos to stand out, you're going to want to go beyond the limited editing controls included in the app. In this video, we're going to take a look at how to edit professional looking vertical videos in Final Cut Pro and upload them to TikTok. Hi, my name is Serge and on this channel, we try and help you make the most out of your equipment and software and tell a better story by making better videos. Today, we're taking a look at editing TikTok videos in Final Cut Pro. Let's jump right in and get started. With your media imported into Final Cut Pro, make a new project. You can upload horizontal or square videos to TikTok, but to make the most out of this mobile platform, you'll want to set the video format to vertical and set the resolution to 1080 by 1920. This gives you a 9 by 16 aspect ratio and uses the entire screen on your mobile device. You can get as fancy as you want for editing your videos, but for this example, let's just add the popular locked on stabilization effect to our clip. Drop your clip into your timeline. And to fill the entire video frame, at the bottom of the video inspector, change the spatial conform type to fill. Now, I've done a full video on this locked on stabilization effect, which I'll link in the end screen, but I'll quickly go over it again. Place your playhead on a frame where your subject's face is clearly visible, and go back to the video inspector. All the way down at the bottom, add a tracker. Set the tracking area over your subject's face, and change your analysis method to machine learning. When tracking common objects like faces, this will give you a more accurate track. Click the Analyze button to track your clip. Once your track is complete, change the scale of this clip to negative 100. Grab the same clip from your media browser and place it directly above your first clip. Change the spatial conform to fill again. Select the Transform tool. And from the tracker drop down menu, add the object track from before to this clip. Open your tracker drop down again, deselect rotation, and change the rotation value in the inspector back to zero. To flip this clip right side up, change the scale all value to negative 100 again. Use the transform tool to center your subject in the video frame and increase the scale of your clip to fill the entire frame. This gives you a school locked on effect where the area you track stays in the same place while the rest of the clip moves around to keep it there. Once your video is ready to post, hit the share button and select export file. In the settings tab, change your format to computer and set the video codec to H.264 better quality. Export your video file. You now have a couple options for uploading this video to TikTok. The easiest way to do it would be to upload it through a web browser. Go to TikTok's website, make sure you're signed in, and hit the upload button in the top right corner. Select your video, add a caption, and select your cover image. Hit post to upload your video to TikTok. Another way to upload your video to TikTok is by using the mobile app. This works great if you want to reuse one of the trending sounds or songs in your TikTok for more exposure. To send your export a clip to your phone, right click on it, select share, and airdrop. In the pop-up window, click on your phone to send this video clip to the photo library on your device. Open up the TikTok app on your phone and scroll through until you find the sound or music track you want to use for your video. Once you find it, click on the track name at the bottom and click on the Use This Sound button. On the right hand side, select Upload, give TikTok access to your video clip in the camera roll, select it, and fill out as much or as little information as possible. Click the Post button to upload your masterpiece to TikTok and get ready for all the money and fame that comes with a viral video. The same method can also be used to make Instagram Reels or even YouTube Shorts. The only thing different is the way you post your videos. My only other advice is keep your videos nice and short. TikTok allows you to upload videos up to 10 minutes long, but trust me, no one wants to watch a 10-minute TikTok. 